Hello, welcome to Sheikh Hayat University, Chicago. Today, we'll understand what are positive economic statements and what are uh, the normative economic statements. Let's uh, understand the concepts initially and I'll define it first, the concepts of the positive and normative economics and then we'll see practically what are its applications in our economy. These statements are basically, number one, if I talk about the positive economic statements, positive economic statements are those statements, those that describe a fact, that describe actually the numbers that must be produced in an economy. For example, if I am saying the Pakistani economy is growing at the rate of 2%, this 2% means, 2% means that the 2% is actually growth of the economy that describes actually the fact therefore these statements i call we call it as a positive economic statements and when i say about the normative economics statements these decide the these statements normally have the words like should be would be ought to be these are the words that are described uh, 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 these are the statements that are described through these words now why these uh, statements are important because because we can we can understand the documents economic documents that are available at the country level and we can describe the faith the benefit these documents can provide to the economy so if i talk let's take an example of the manifesto of some political organization uh, that particular organization is basically uh, Pakistan people's party i will explain the uh, concepts of the positive and normative statements that are available in this particular slide. So, uh, if I talk about that, if I say word, if I say economy, let's look at one statement here. It says the continue our engagement with Pakistanis abroad, with with Pakistanis abroad. If I if I can broaden it. And make it visible to you. So, continue the engagement with the Pakistanis abroad, facilitate their travel and strengthen their ties with the national economy by increasing, improving their access to the investments at home. This actually is a normative statement because it doesn't give you the fact. And similarly, this, this manifesto has got the many statements. One, some statements would be positive and some statements would be normative. Now if I say the Pakistan economy, if this, this manifesto says Pakistan economy is actually growing at the rate of 2%, it means that statement would be called as positive economics. We'll meet you with the next, with the next topic uh, in our next video. Stay connected. Thank you.